Hey guys, um, I just did a speed test on NordVPN and TorGuard. If you haven't seen that video, go ahead and check that out. I did extensive speed tests and torrent tests comparing NordVPN and TorGuard. So if you want to find out who won in that video, go check that out. But in that video, I did get someone saying like, hey, you should use the P2P optimized servers. So that led me to the curiosity of thinking, you know, do these P2P servers really give you that much better speeds than NordVPN's regular servers? Or are they just kind of named that way for some arbitrary reason. So today I'm going to be testing that out. Do the P2P servers from NordVPN really do that much more than their regular servers? We're going to download it twice with both the P2P server. As you can see here, I am connected to the P2P one. All right, so we are starting it up and we'll measure the speeds. Um, probably should be around 50 to 70 megabytes is kind of what I would expect. And right now we're in around the 44 region. So basically what we're going to have to do is put it to five minutes. And then we'll compare this current P2P test um, with a regular NordVPN server. See which one is faster or if there's really that much difference. You know, should you be using that one specifically or just the regular servers? Let's go ahead and find out. All right, we're running this test here a bit. All right, so we are done. Now let's go ahead and stop that. Um, here we are. Okay, just about done here. All right, done. We'll delete that. And now we will con quick connect to a regular server to test the differences. And we are connected. So let's go ahead and see. We're comparing a regular server, not the P2P optimized one, with that of um, the P2P one. So is there much difference? Did that invalidate the previous speed test? Um, right now, it doesn't seem like it's that much difference. Uh, we're getting pretty similar peaks here. I'm going up to around a similar region as you could see in the two different tests. Um, and we're downloading it very quickly. So both of these are doing very well. Um, right here we actually got a new peak that surpassed the previous peak. Um, and yeah, so from these tests alone, um, just this test, this was the quick, uh, the P2P and this was the quick connect. It doesn't seem like there's really that much difference in the server's speeds, meaning that the test I did yesterday should be fine. Um, both of these offer great speeds from NordVPN um, with not that much differences from what I could tell. So whether you want to click Quick Connect or P2P, doesn't really seem to matter in my tests. Uh, maybe you could do your own test and find out how it works for you though. Anyways guys, just a quick little update video um, after doing my video yesterday, and I'll see you again very soon.